Hi. <laughs> Thank you for finding the time to come Thanks today. Thanks for having me. Obviously, there's going to be lots more we're going to talk about to the BRIC students later mm -hmm. on this year. Yeah. But um, as an artist in a certain show in the <laughs> West End, um, how long have you been with the show now? Um, I've been with the show since the end of 2016. So we started doing press launches and stuff like that. And um, yeah, been with the show since then. And have you seen a change as an artist from... December the 10th, 2016, when we started rehearsals, through until today, Absolutely. August 2018. I mean, we've had a couple of cast changes and stuff like that, so you're continually growing through your character, um, finding new paths and stuff with different characters. Um, we've had a lot of changes, which has been great. Change is good. So um, it's been a real, real journey. It's been hard, but loving every second. You use the word journey. Yes. Now, I've never been a performer. I've never wanted to be. I'm not good enough to be a performer. <laughs> I hope to think I can do some other things. Yes. <laughs> but um, as a performer, and as an actress in 2018, in the last few years, there have been numerous reports in papers how things are having to change. And I'm pleased to say, I don't think we've ever had situations that have been reported into the press in any of my shows, or certainly not on this show. But as a female artist of today, who's also a leading artist, who also would look at this and go, this is extremely strong as a female. What would you say to students that are just coming out? Because I'm sure some may will be scared. Oh, I mean, it's terrifying. I was so terrified when I graduated. Um, and there wasn't much around strong female-wise when I graduated a few years ago. Um, <laughs> but um, this show especially, it has such strong female leading characters. In fact, all the ensemble even, they're all, they found their own path. And we have same-sex couples, which is really great and really important, I think. Um, but it's just nice to be playing a strong female that is actually leading the way because the guy's chasing the girl for once, which never happens. So I'm so glad that that is happening in this show. Triple threats. Yes. So many people use these words. It's a word that is getting stronger in the United Kingdom and it's used a lot in the US. Mm -hmm. But I know that from auditions that I've been to and I see artists coming in these days, you, you have a huge presence and have a huge amazing professional ability to be able to sing dance act and be able to not only do those three but you're able to break the fourth wall too which is important mm -hmm. as yeah. an artist also keeping the integrity of your character which i think is a huge accomplishment and i'm bowing my hat to you but triple threat, not everyone's great at doing everything. No, I mean, I, when I was at college, I went to college as a primarily a singer um, and I'd never danced before. So when I was at college, I focused more on my dancing and my acting because I knew that my singing was okay and I went to those classes, but I knew that I needed to be able to, if I wanted to dance in the ensemble, I needed to get my dancing strength up. Um, so I really tried really hard in those classes um, and really pushed myself, um, which was scary because I was surrounded by people that had been dancing since they were two years old. Um, so that was scary, but I think it's important that you can switch between the three. I'm going to leave the shot to just you now, okay. just to finish off by asking a question that I'm sure the students of whatever age will be asking an actress like yourself. I'm sure actress, actor, in the end, everyone's pinnacle is doing a particular role. Mm -hmm. It may not be in the West End, it may be on a tour, yeah. it may well be in a repertory theatre, maybe be a dance company, mm -hmm. but you as a leading performer in your industry now, what would you tell BRIC students that they should be looking out for in the year ahead okay. in 2018? Okay. So um, it's very hard, <laughs> it's very hard, but you just have to take everything on board, eat it all up, listen to everything. Um, you might not think it applies to you, but you never know, you might need it later on down the line. Um, and also be kind to everyone because you just never know that person next to you could be casting you in a show one day. Um, so just take everything on board, be kind, um, yeah, and just have fun. Enjoy, don't take it too seriously. That's another thing. So um, yeah, just enjoy every single moment and work hard.